Shield Forecast with Stephanie Mead. Well, fog is still an issue for your Monday morning commute. We're looking at the densest fog right now down towards the Fox Valley. So around three quarters of a mile in Appleton, a mile in Oshkosh. Right now, we're seeing brief improvements out towards Ephraim. That was at around a quarter of a mile earlier. Now at a half a mile and a half a mile out towards Sturgeon Bay. Right now, not quite as heavy here in Green Bay, but we're still seeing around six miles of visibility. But very mild as you're heading out the door. 37 in Green Bay right now, 36 in Appleton, 37 out towards Wapaka with mostly cloudy skies. And as you notice here on radar, we're not really going to see too much activity throughout the day. Staying mostly cloudy and quiet. Still seeing a little bit of fog lingering around. However, that won't last for too much longer. We do have a storm system on the way which will bring us a wintry mix, rain transitioning into snow. For some locations, they will see that mix throughout the overnight hours into the early hours of Wednesday. Primarily snow showers, though, northwest of Green Bay. Area southwest of us seeing that mixture. And then Wednesday morning looking like a, a rough commute, seeing as that we'll see mostly snow-covered road conditions. Low pressure system we saw throughout the weekend will shift off towards the east, and then we see developing low off towards the west. That's going to bring us the wintry weather as we head into Tuesday night and into Wednesday. And because of that, a lot of states off towards the west, so the northern half of Iowa, southern half of Minnesota, and much of the Dakotas and Nebraska are under that winter storm watch that starts tonight and lasts into Tuesday and Wednesday. So as we go into SkyCast, we are looking at primarily quiet conditions up until around 3 o'clock Tuesday, mostly cloudy skies, and then snow showers start to develop, primarily off towards the lakeshore, seeing that mixture. And then at around 5.30 a.m., we will see mostly snow showers. So we could see snow accumulations upwards to around 3 inches when it's all said and done, then rain and sleet down towards the Sheboygan and uh, Manitowoc area. But at around 7.30 during the morning on uh, Wednesday, we're looking at around an inch and a half of accumulations. Areas northwest looking at around two inches of accumulations as we head into Wednesday afternoon. So our extended forecast calling for temperatures to remain mild in the mid to upper 30s throughout Tuesday and Wednesday. Then Thursday, high of 36. We start to cool off a little bit as we head into the end of the week and into this weekend with high temperatures returning to near seasonal in the upper 20s, but we do dry out a bit and we see a little bit of sunshine. So these gloomy conditions aren't going to last forever. We do see a little sun, but we just have to make it through the work week, unfortunately. Really looking forward to uh, that sun and maybe a little snow mm -hmm. to cover up some of the patches that are left over of all that melted stuff. Yeah, gross out you there. know, it does look kind of kind of gross out there. I was yeah. thinking about that <laughs> on my drive home yesterday, but you know, we do see a little bit of snow in the forecast. So hopefully again, like you mentioned, it does cover that kind of grossness up. All right.